Hi, I'd like to show you how to use Mac Repertory to aid your work in group analysis, in particular where you need to do some selective sampling of remedies in a specific group. Now we could do our so select remedies on the basis of our knowledge of how well we know they are proven, historical knowledge of proving and validation. We could choose it on how well it is known in the literature. But another way of choosing and selecting a remedy for a sampling exercise would be to compare how it does in terms of rubrics. So in this case we could imagine, I'm going to give the example of the Asteraceae family, the plant family, where I want to compare a few remedies to see how well they are represented in terms of their mind symptoms. So I'm restricting this uh, group analysis to the mind chapter in the repertory using Complete Repertory 2018. So to start, one would go to the search and one could use remedies and words. And what I would do over here, uh, let me first um, clear this. I would choose the families A to Z and I would choose, I can type in AST, the Asteraceae families and I will select that. So that has given me the Asteraceae uh, members inside here. Uh, we can see that there's quite a lot of them. I'm going to leave everything as is over here match at least one because I want to see uh, all the rubrics where at least one of the remedies is included in the mind or mental symptoms of the, rub of the repertory. So I must go down to the and reduce this over here. I'm going to so the section is already set to mind. I'm going to leave that there. I'm just going to change this to clipboard A and I can press empty beforehand in case there was something there. So now we go on to the search. So there's 233 remedies and let us see what it finds. So it's finding 2833 rubrics from the mind section where there is at least one mention of or one uh, of the Asteraceae remedies coming up in that rubric. So that gives us a baseline to work with that 2833 as the total amount of rubrics uh, where Asteraceae are represented in the mind section of the repertory. Now I would imagine that Arnica is a well-proven and a well-represented remedy. So I'm going to use search on that one now specifically and see what would be the comparison with the total that we've just seen here. So we go back to search remedies and words. I'm going to clear this again. And now I'm going to type in just the abbreviation for Arnica ARN. If you don't know it, you can choose it from here and just start typing in the first few, and uh, sorry, A-R-N, and you can find Arnica or Arnica Montana over there. I'll leave it as it is, and I need to change this again to the section of the mind. In this case, we're going to go, I want to put this into clipboard B, um, and I will... In fact, what I'll do is I'll put that back into clipboard A and I'll just empty the clipboard before placing it in there. Click on the search and let's see what it comes up with. Okay, so what it's found, it's found 939 rubrics where Arnica specifically is a part of the Asteraceae contingent in the the mind uh, section, the mind chapter of the room. So that, we could express that as 939 over 2833. Remember 2833 was the amount of rubrics that the Asteraceae in total would have shown up. But specifically Arnica, perhaps Arnica and others 
would be in 939 of those. If we wanted to look at that in a, in a bit more fine detail, we could go to the rubrics menu and then go to sort and ch sort to number of remedies. And so that will sort it with the ones where Arnica appears as a single remedy. And uh, we can go down here. We can see it's a single remedy. Quite a few of these are, say, triple underlined, or some might have a double heavy underline like this over here. So it's coming up in a higher grade. But what we're finding is that 51 of the rubrics Arnica features as a, a single remedy within that rubric. Okay, so we note that and um, let us now go to compare it with another member of the Asteraceae. I'll close that clipboard. We can see it's still the active clipboard. I'll go into clipboard B to make that the active one now and move on to my search. The same method again, remedies and words, but this time I'm going to clear it again. But we're going to work with chamomilla and change the section here to mind. It's going to go to clipboard B already, that's fine. You could just empty that in case and search. So this is quite surprising to me. A chamomilla is has a higher representation on the basis of number of rubrics in the mind chip. We see there are one, two, seven, nine, as opposed to the um, what was it of the arnica was nine three nine. Let's also compare now the relative um, exclusivity of chamomilla and sort this clipboard into the number of remedies and so we see here where it is one remedy chamomilla is the sole representative in the rubric and it goes on and on and it goes up to 73 so again that's a higher number than we saw in the arnica there are further ways of carrying on our comparison between remedies in the same family and one way would be to let's move on to clipboard C as we've opened a blank clipboard we're going to search remedies and words and this time let's go back to Arnica now, what we want to do now is we want to see in how many remedies or how many rubrics does Arnica come out as either bold or bold italics. We're going to knock out the same remedies that doesn't apply in this case. Uh, it's going to go to clipboard C. We don't mind emptying that clipboard before and although it is already empty and we're working on the section of the mind. So we do the search here. And so what we see there's 59 rubrics where uh, Arnica is at in the higher grades. Okay, so let's now move on to the comparison with chamomilla. Let's go to clipboard D and we can go to search remedies and words. I'm going to do the same thing again but just change this to chamomilla. And it's going to go to clipboard D, empty and so forth. The search And so what we find here is that at the higher levels, the higher grades, a chamomilla scores higher than Arnica as well, with in 101 rubrics as opposed to the 59 of Arnica. So it might we could say on this kind of quantitative basis or comparison that uh, chamomilla actually has more um, coverage or there are more rubrics in the mind section of the repertory than Arnica and so it might be more representative than Arnica 
and it might be the better choice to make if we were choosing a remedy to characterize the mind section of the Asteraceae. Thank you very much.